Hey everyone, I'm back and today I'm going to be explaining a few things and I'm going to be showing you how to use the Little Big Planet 1 DLC editor. So you can wear what this allows you to do when you use this actually. Uh, it allows you to wear the crown, the bug blaster, the beta vest, all those different shirts and DLCs you can never have and own because you were never picked for the Little Big Planet betas or you were never given the crown or anything. So the first thing I'm gonna have I'm gonna have you guys do is go to profile settings and then don't mind import profile, but go to backup profile. Uh you're gonna press X and new save data, yes. And it's going to be saving. So what this does is that all your progress right now uh that you have on this game, maybe you're trophy hunting, maybe you do something uh you have costumes or something like that. You don't wanna lose them. You don't wanna you know destroy uh, whatever you have on here so you're going to back it up like I did and Sean and showed you and then you're gonna to go to search text and then you're gonna put DLC editor editor <laughs> editor so you go right there editor okay and you're gonna look for one I do not have one in particular to use I don't know which one to use cuz <laughs> My friend made, uh, told me to make a video on how to use this properly, so I'm actually going to be explaining. Uh, I don't have uh, one that I, I know that will work, so I'm gonna, just going to try to uh, look at these pictures and actually see if people actually got the DLC they wanted to wear. So I'm actually going to probably look, do this one, I'm not sure. Um, I'm going to copy it. Uh, Oh my god, the deck creator's copying levels, no, oh gee, he's ruining the community. I'm actually not really ruining the community, but um, uh, you know, you have all rights to copy whatever you want on this game. Um, people actually uh, blame me for copying levels and stuff, but I don't really care anymore. Um, say, like, I don't even care what they say. But I'm gonna ha keep that one on my moon just in case uh, I don't find anyone, any other one, I mean. So I can just go straight up there and uh, just play it. But I'm gonna second page, I'm gonna look in this one. Hello and welcome. Nope, nope, nope. Um, I'm gonna play on my own just for the sake of it uh, so no one joins and messes up the transaction on what happens here. So this is free, by the way. This is like something you can do. It you won't get banned. You won't like get suspended on your account, or or you won't get moderated or anything like that. It's not like uh, what should I what should I call it? Um, it's not violating the U A L U E U L A. <laughs> Can't say that right. All right. So here's gonna tell you every time you use this level, back up your profile. Start settings profile, backup profile. This glitch only works in Little Planet 1, not 2. If it doesn't work, restart Little Planet 1. Besides, it changes the structure of your sack boy. So it will make the sack boy really small. Instructions, please press the button with the costume which you want to wear. Important, do not play this level with four players. It will freeze your PS3. I recommended to play this level alone. Enjoy the costumes. Enjoy your costumes, okay. And <laughs> it has a set button there. Okay. So, this teleports you to floor two. So, this is what it's telling you right now is that basically what I told you guys already. Uh, it's, it's just briefing you for those of you that uh, already played this and already know how to do this. I uh, probably got it from here. And you know the rules, you know. You know what you gotta do. And it's, it's, uh, <laughs> it's telling you to back up on the bottom there uh, I just made the backup uh, thing in the beginning because people don't know how to back up uh, so yeah I'm gonna pick that one and boom there you have it guys I have the crown which I already own it's kind of weird that I'm wearing the crown again which I already own uh, I do own the bug blaster spray can thing the glove on the left and the right so I do own this. It's kind of weird. I can take it off, take it back on, put it back on. I mean, uh, what I don't have right now, which I really would love, 
if I can get a sponsorship by <laughs> Little Big Planet and get that shirt <laughs> for sponsoring the game and stuff, I would really love that PSP shirt, but whatever. Um, what I do have is the crown, uh, but I don't have that shirt. So I'm just gonna take a picture here, look like a king, a boss, or whatever you want to call it, uh, <laughs> with all this DLC. God of all glitches. Alright, so there you have it, guys. I'm gonna go back and pod. Really cool level, actually. Oh, and I got a trophy. Look at that. I'm gonna raid it. I'm gonna pick um, uh, that one. Okay. Uh, first, nice. Another trophy. Okay, so here you go. Oops. Okay. Here you go, guys. Oh, another trophy. Wow. Three trophies in a row. That's nice. There you have it, guys. Um, there is the crown. Um, not really anything special about the crown. You can wear it. It's just a DLC. It's just to show off that you are a real creator or you earned it in a competition. Uh, I do not have that shirt, the star shirt, the PSP star shirt launch or the PSP launch t-shirt, which is another rare. I do not have that, but I do have the bug blaster hands and outfit which is really nice too but i don't know any costumes to wear it with so i rarely wear that which is kind of weird because it's so rare but i just don't like wearing it so right here i'm going to actually show you my dead creator account um yes if you guys don't know which most of you guys know i am the dead creator i can't tilt my head uh, i can't move or like hump anything because <laughs> Uh, I'm using a PlayStation 4 remote for this, uh, connected to a USB uh, wire, USB to the PS4, so I can actually use it. I don't have my other PS3 remote with me, so I'm actually going to show you the difference. I'm actually going to pick blue. Yeah, there you go. I'm going to show you the difference on what your Sackboy would look like after you use the DLC editor. Uh, of course, you would have DLC. Uh, I do have most of the DLC on that editor anyways. See, like I said right there, I have that. And um, I'm going to go down here and look for the crown. Nothing really changed with the crown or anything like that. It's just the same, uh, except the little sack boy is smaller now. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, there's no more, like, comparison difference differences. But, uh, yeah, you know, that that's pretty much it for the editor. I give it a 4 out of 5 stars because it actually allows you to wear something you don't earn. You haven't earned or you don't have. Which is kind of cool because it's a little bit planet one. And that's another issue here as well. If you do the editor and you don't back up and you're just uh, thinking that it's going to go away after you uh, close out of the game or exit out of the game, this is going to happen to your uh, profile every single time you get on little bit planet. It's going to <laughs> make you just float around and do like somersaults and whatever and whatnot so yeah you're gonna be stuck like that forever if you don't back up your profile but uh that's pretty much it for this video i have another video coming out soon this week which well i'm going to be explaining a few other things on little bit planet uh, i hope you hopefully you guys check that one out um but yeah you know and i'm actually going to show you right here how to import so import you go to import and then you import your profile as a grand creator um, and boom there you go um, I did turn off the PS4 remote so don't don't be like whoa just it closed out of my other profile um, I'm just gonna wait until this connection to LBP online loads okay and there you have it guys I mean boom like <laughs> the sack boy isn't really that short anymore so that's pretty cool uh, all your stuff all your trophies data data and anything else costumes you have will be loaded back up and that's what happens when you do a DLC editor and you import your stuff back uh, like I was saying please like and subscribe subscribe if you haven't already you know subscribing does help the channel like I always say in all my videos shout out to one of my friends a it's Isaac on YouTube check him out um, he uploads a few trick shots from here and there I don't know what he else he uploads but um, he earned the <laughs> Here in the shout out, but that's pretty much it for this video, and have a good one. Uh, it's not like, uh, what should I, what should I call it? Um, it's not violating the UELA, U, E-U-L-A, <laughs> can't say that right. 
All right, so here's gonna tell you every time you use this level, back up your profile, start settings, profile, backup profile. This glitch only works in a little planet one, not two. If it doesn't work, restart Little Big Planet 1. Besides, it changes the structure of your sack boy. So it will make the sack boy really small. Instructions, please press the button with the costume which you want to wear. Important, do not play this level with four players. It will freeze your PS3. I recommend it to play this level alone. Enjoy the costumes. Enjoy your costumes, okay. <laughs> and it has a set button there. Okay. So, this teleports you to floor two. So, this is what it's telling you right now is that basically what I told you guys already. Uh, it's, it's just briefing you for those of you that uh, already played this and already know how to do this. I uh, probably got it from here. And you know the rules, you know, you know what you got to do. And it's, it's, uh, <laughs> it's telling you to back up on the bottom there. Uh, I just made the backup uh, thing in the beginning because people don't know how to back up. Uh, so yeah. I'm gonna pick that one. And boom. There you have it guys. I have the... Hey everyone, I'm back. And today I'm going to be explaining a few things. And I'm going to be showing you how to use the Little Big Planet 1 DLC editor. So you can wear what this allows you to do when you use this actually. Uh, it allows you to wear the crown, the bug blaster, the beta vest, all those different shirts and DLCs you can never have and own because you were never picked for the Little Bit Planet betas or you were never given the crown or anything. So the first thing I'm going to have you guys do is go to profile settings and then don't mind import profile, but go to backup profile. Uh, you're going to press X, new save data. Yes and it's going to be saving so what this does is that all your progress right now uh that you have on this game maybe you're trophy hunting maybe you do something uh you have costumes or something like that you don't want to lose them you don't want to you know destroy uh whatever you have on here so you're going to back it up like i did and sean and <laughs> showed you and then you're going to go to search text and then you're going to put dlc editor editor <laughs> editor so you go right there, editor, okay. And you're gonna look for one. I do not have one in particular to use. I don't know which one to use because <laughs> my friend made uh, told me to make a video on how to use this properly. So I'm actually going to be explaining. Uh, I don't have uh, one that I, I know that will work. So I'm gonna, just gonna try to uh, look at these pictures and actually see if people actually got the DLC they wanted to wear. So I'm actually going to probably look, do this one. I'm not sure. Um, I'm going to copy it. Uh, oh my god. The deck creator's copying levels. No. Oh, gee. He's ruining the community. I'm actually not really ruining the community. But, um, <laughs> uh, you know, you have all rights to copy whatever you want on this game. Um... People actually uh, blame me for copying levels and stuff, but I don't really care anymore. Um, say like I don't even care what they say, but I'm gonna ha keep that one on my moon just in case uh, I don't find anyone, any other one. I mean, so I can just go straight up there and uh, just play it. But I'm gonna second page. I'm gonna look in this one. Hello and welcome. Nope. 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 Um. I'm going to play on my own, just for the sake of it, uh, so no one joins and messes up the transaction on what happens here. So this is free, by the way. This is, like, something you can do. It You won't get banned. You won't, like, get suspended on your account, or, or you won't get moderated or anything like that. Crown, which I already own. It's kind of weird that I'm wearing the crown again, which I already own. Uh, I do own the Bug Blaster spray can thing the glove on the left and the right so i do own this it's kind of weird i can take it off take it back on put it back on i mean uh what i don't have right now which i really would love if i can get a sponsorship by <laughs> little big planet and get that shirt <laughs> for sponsoring the game and stuff i would really love that psp shirt but whatever um what i do have is the crown 
uh, but I don't have that shirt. So I'm just gonna take a picture here, look like a king, a boss, or whatever you want to call it, uh, <laughs> with all this DLC. God of all glitches. All right, so there you have it, guys. I'm gonna go back and pod. Really cool level, actually. Oh, and I got a trophy. Look at that. I'm gonna raid it. I'm gonna pick um, uh, that one. Okay. Uh, first, nice, another trophy. Okay, so here you go. Oops. Okay, here you go, guys. Oh, another trophy. Wow, three trophies in a row. That's nice. There you have it, guys. Um, there is the crown. Um, not really anything special about the crown. You can wear it. It's just a DLC. It's just to show off that you are a real creator or you earned it in a competition. I uh, I do not have that shirt, the star shirt, the PSP star shirt launch or the PSP launch T-shirt, which is a, another rare. Uh, I do not have that, but I do have the Bug Blaster hands and outfit, which is really nice too. But I don't know any costumes to wear it with, so I rarely wear that, which is kind of weird because it's so rare. But I just don't like wearing it. So right here, I'm gonna actually show you my dead creator account um yes if you guys don't know which most of you guys know i am the dead creator i can't tilt my head uh, i can't move or like hump anything because <laughs> uh, i'm using a playstation 4 remote for this uh connected to a usb uh wire usb to the ps4 so i can actually use it i don't have my other ps3 remote with me so i'm actually going to show you the difference i'm actually gonna pick blue yeah there you go I'm going to show you the difference on what your Sackboy would look like after you use the DLC editor. Uh, of course, you would have DLC. Uh, I do have most of the DLC on that editor anyways. See, like I said right there, I have that. And um, I'm going to go down here and look for the crown. Nothing really changed with the crown or anything like that. It's just the same, uh, except the little Sackboy is smaller now. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, there is no more like 